guys. Welcome to the shop. Today? Well, I took a trip to Denver, Colorado, met up with my friend with an NC Miata, and we're going to go on some night drifting. So let's check this car out. Finally, with Michael and his Miata. Yeah. So we're thinking about going out tonight, doing a night toge through the mountains and the valleys, I guess, or canyons, however you want to say them. And uh, we're gonna see how this little supercharged, uh, 250 horsepower, NA, your NB, now your NC. Correct. Yeah, I'm slow with these. I'm, I'm slow like these things are. <laughs> but. Uh, yeah, uh, stats of this thing, what, 250 horsepower, uh, what's the torques? 210. Oh, oh. oh yeah. What all's done to it? So we got the Cosworth or FM supercharger with a upgraded pulley, got the uh, fuel pump upgraded as well as the injectors as well, a intake for that supercharger, full exhaust from Goodwin Racing. I uh, got the Meister R race series of coilovers. Then got sway bars in the front and rear with adjustable end links. And uh, obviously that's been aligned properly as well. Got some Inky RPF1 wheels with some Falcon RT660 rubber covering those. Um, has been tuned. Uh, that's what the numbers uh, came from there. So those are not estimated. Those are from a dyno here in Colorado. And um, I think that is about it. Uh, battery relocation as well as uh, air, air oil separator. All right. So this is the plan for this weekend is tonight we're going to go do uh, night toge and make sure this thing's running good. Tomorrow we're going to go uh, hopefully to Pikes Peak and just get a look at that and play around a little bit and then go to Pikes Peak International Raceway for the slush event this year and camp out and do some hot laps tomorrow night and then stay through the night and Saturday we're having a full-fledged day of PPR Absolutely. with hot laps, drifting, burnouts, car show, and Colorado sun. Sunscreen for me so I don't end up this color. So, we'll see y'all in a little bit when we get this uh, toge run going. Yep.
now she's back in her home on a wild trip. Whew. This thing's fun. Oh yeah, I enjoyed it. We gotta get the GoPros out and get the footage. But uh, yeah, thank you, sir. Good times. Uh, for making me white knuckle and uh, pucker in places <laughs> I shouldn't. But uh, the mountains are fun and scary in the passenger seat. I don't feel like I have control in the passenger seat at all. Good. Stop that. <laughs> but anyway, uh, yeah, so uh, I don't know how long this video is, but hopefully that concludes for the evening and the travel day and everything else because it was a uh, an experience. A lot of driving. Y'all didn't get half of it, but and y'all probably didn't experience what I experienced or he experienced because, uh, yeah, you weren't there. There was a lot of G-forces and... Uh, a lot of speed, a lot of corners, a lot of braking. <laughs> uh, it was fun. But uh makes me want another car. More nimble. Better than 240 because it's kind of thick. She's a big girl-ish. But, yeah, we're going to see what this thing does tomorrow. So, Tonight we're going to get uh, get ourselves ready for packing tomorrow, and then we're going to hopefully go to Pikes Peak, and then PPIR, and start our weekend off at PPIR. So, it'll be enjoyable. It's going to be a harsh road trip <laughs> for probably about uh, three hours. A very tight road trip. Yeah. A little car. we got to pack this thing full. <laughs> we don't have a trailer. We don't have a support vehicle. It's us and whatever we slam in here, and okay. since... We're, we're camping and we're bringing extra fuel and drinks and food and everything else for the weekend. Yes, yeah, it's going to be it's going to be a different story on the whole entire aspect of tight net group. Me and him, cameras, maybe a computer and the joys of a Miata. Oh yeah. So but we can just definitely say that this is the joys of Miata weekend <laughs> uh, in Colorado. A little different. It's not as cool as some of the other vehicles because uh, I do like overlanding. And uh, that there is one truck. There's many trucks in these parking lots that are meant for that. But right now we're focused in on this dark thing you can't really see because I keep zooming in. So... Yeah. Well, I will see y'all in the morning. And you can't see Michael. I am let's, back here. Let's turn light. There we go. We'll turn the light on. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so, see y'all in the morning. And we're going to take advantage of this road trip and uh, let y'all know how this goes. So, till tomorrow.